A police officer's duty is to protect and serve. One Grand Prairie police officer proved it's something he certainly doesn't take lightly. New at 10, Aaron Jones, live at Asia Times Square to explain what happened. Aaron. Dan, the Mid-Autumn Festival brings in thousands of people. Friday, we're told this street was packed when the officer spotted a choking child and stepped into action. Thank you, my friend. When Grand Prairie officer A.J. Castaneda learned he had to take CPR training, he wasn't too enthused. I'm going to be honest with you. At first, I was always like, never going to use this, never going to use this. And then all of a sudden, guess who used it? Friday night, he was working security at the Mid-Autumn Festival at Asia Times Square when he spotted a woman and her one-year-old son in distress. The child was just lifeless. Uh, this, the, the arms and lang, uh, legs were just dangling there as she ran towards me. She was Nigerian. Huge language barrier. But the officer knew what to do, giving the child back blows until he spit out a white object and started breathing again. I got kind of teary eyed because, you know, it's very emotional because you have a child's life in your hands and it's very, very emotional. In the days following, Castaneda has been called a hero, lifesaver, and blessing on social media. I'm just doing my job. To me, he is a hero. For him, he's just thinking this in everyday life. That's amazing. That speaks volume about his character. Whatever I can do for the children of the world, I, I want to I give, give. Children are great. They're our future. <laughs> and as a precaution, paramedics did take the child to the hospital on Friday. Tonight, we're told the child is doing great. Live in Grand Prairie, Aaron Jones, CBS 11 News. I